Perhaps you've heard good things about R, but have been reticent to give it a try due to its difficulty. Perhaps you're coming from Excel and have run into the wall of what can be done within that environment. R is an incredibly powerful programming language that academic statisticians use to get the job done. Deducer is a project that is designed to bring R's power to the non-programmer. Deducer consists of two items. The first is the console. This is what you might consider a regular R console. Output from the from statistical analysis is displayed in the output and uh, programming constructs can be entered into the input area. Also there's a data viewer uh, where we will see data once we've loaded it in. So let's load in some data. Right now we're going to load in a data set called states which contains educational information about each one of the states. It's in a CSV file. There's a number of different formats that we can load um, data in. So we'll go ahead and load that in. It looks correctly formatted, so let's load it. We see a nice striped data editor, um, and we can edit our variables much in the same way that we can edit in Excel. Copy and paste is supported. Uh, so example, here we see the state name. Let's go ahead and change its label. So easy as Excel to edit. So there's three main menus as far as doing data manipulation and analysis. We've got data, analysis, and plots. Data is for data manipulation. Analysis is for various statistical analyses that one might be interested in. And plots is for plots. In this data set, we have the SA average SAT scores for um, high school students exiting. And we also have the amount of dollars spent per high school and the pay of the teachers in thousands. So let's go ahead and explore this using plots. We'll go ahead and add some scatter plots in here. And look at the SAT verbal on the y axis and dollars on the x. Very easy to make a plot and to add a smoothing line, we just drag that on. It's designed to be intuitive so that even the most beginner user can uh, execute commands very easily. But it's also very powerful and we can, um, we can for example, make the point size proportional to the size of the population of the state. So we're able to make custom plots very easily. We can also do uh, more complicated analyses like linear regression, the outcome as um, the SAT, and two um, and our three predictors: the dollars spent on students, their pay, and the population of the state. And we can build any sort of complicated model that we want. Let's do a full factorial. This includes all interaction terms. And here we get a linear model. We can view diagnostics, look at effects plots, and various other options. And then we can run it, and we can see the output in our console. So as you can see, it's a very flexible tool, but easy to use. Um, you don't need to no programming, and you don't need to understand the, uh, the different calls that are exported to the console. And it's a good introduction to R, and you don't actually ever need to leave the GUI to make some really powerful statistical analyses. And it's also powerful for expert users, but I'll go into that in different, um, a different video.